Hello Americans and other friends and subscribers around the world. So we're uh um we're back. <laughs> Time for a little uh mountain junkers update from the Hillbilly headquarters here. It's actually a Sunday morning. I just got done watching my Sunday morning. And we thought uh um and I'm still in my sweat. <laughs> so we thought we'd start off the Boy, oh, you look serious. <laughs> You're scary. Survey again, and the option is now gone. Oh, the survey on YouTube? Yeah, we got halfway through this big long survey thing, and then I, the told and I told Miss Kitty, go to that back button. She hits it, man. It's all gone after all these things we'd wrote. Oops. But um, anyway, you know, uh, this video is actually going to be, you know, today's Monday, so I actually did this yesterday, but. Uh, Thought we'd do the this one now. I've been doing some scheduling on the videos and stuff, which is kind of kind of helpful. So that way, like when we do take a road trip, we can actually have a video scheduled. Right. Old Grizz was the one. Right. And during said our he day, done that. We can yeah. film as we go and not feel like we have to hurry up and right get rush it one and then go put it on right. Yeah, because I mean, there's days yeah. we'll go out, man. We film it, we get back, man, or squish it. You know, yeah. stay up all night yeah. doing it. You know, take some time to get it all together. So anyway, what we're going to go over today is obviously just a short period of time because it'll be uh, what we're showing today. We sold Friday night and uh, Saturday, you know, on Sundays. We actually made a couple sales this morning, I think, already. Mm -hmm. But Sunday nights, we usually do really well. So that yeah. stuff won't be on this one. It probably won't be on the next yeah. one because Miss Kitty's well, been yeah, staying we on were, top of yeah, it. Yeah, we were discussing that because we do like to share, you know, things that we've sold um, throughout the week. Um, keep an eye on the battery there. I just noticed that it's flashing. Oh, man. Um, but we like Every to share time. what we've sold, but... But we like to do next day shipping. Right. Yeah. So it's not like we can hold off on our shipping until the end of the week and then show you. So we were thinking about maybe doing um, small clips throughout the week and then putting them all together. Yeah, especially on so some of this. So maybe you know, we could try that. What was it that I sold that I was like, man, i got to make sure I put that on there. Um, There's been a couple things just the most. This last time. week, yeah, this last week's been actually pretty dang good on eBay. Um, man, there's something I can't. Maybe a book <laughs> it's funny, man. Yeah, woo, woo, woo. Yeah. But uh. I'm never uh, gonna forget that. Yeah, I'm not gonna forget what that. I'm gonna tell them about that one. <laughs> I'm gonna click off here and put this dang battery in this camera. All right, now we're back again. <laughs> so um. So we're gonna go over the mountain junkers. Like I said, it's what we've sold Friday night and Saturday, and I think just one or two little things this morning. So let's get going here. Or right, do you have any announcements to make, Miss Kitty? Did I forget about one? I don't know. Okay. <laughs> I'm just finding out. Last time you surprised me, man. It turned into the Kitty Show. All right, we'll start off with. Well, the one I really didn't care if I sold it. I actually, I thought Doug, or Doug and Stacy, I thought he was going, I man, I made him a heck of a deal, but him not buying it actually made me more money, so I'm happy. <laughs> <laughs> but the my old, uh, I don't even know how you pronounce it, Sholnoff, um vintage rifle uh, scabbard, um, $116 shipped. So that, uh, I'll take it over here. Yeah, that was a pretty good one, man. I would made Doug or told Doug I'd give it to him for a pretty good deal. Um, and then when he didn't buy it, I was just going to actually let it in this time because I was keeping my little pump right here in it. My very favorite gun of all guns. And uh, I thought, well, if that mother don't sell this last run, I think I'm just going to keep it. And, of course, as soon as you decide that, it sells. So anyway, so that was a pretty good one. And then we've got, I thought I had this all set up, man, sorry. That's okay. I'm an amateur here. That's okay. No, I'm getting messages. Grizz well, is messaging. You didn't messaging. get all those notifications popping up all the time. It's Grizz, man. I know. <laughs> Always make time for Grizz. All right, what do we got here? Oh, man. Okay. I think I know what I'm doing now. Dun, 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 dun. No rush, it's Sunday, man. Sunday's like right. our day Take it slow, that I get to easy. tell Miss Kitty, don't you tell me what to do. <laughs> 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 it's Sunday. All right, we'll start off. Was this uh, 
that church key that I uh, I think I, pound, or I pounded this out in one of the blacksmith videos mm -hmm. and it sold by the end of that day and I actually need to get out there and pound out another one man it's nice yeah. so that was the first one sold that for thirty dollars and forty five cents shipped you want me to hand all yeah, this stuff to you do. don't yeah. cut my finger off please I won't. I all promise. right and I don't think I want to say uh, <laughs> so don't, don't say well, it. Yeah, well, I got a viewer that <laughs> bought some knives and stuff, and I don't know if I really want to say that. Well, their... I don't know what their YouTube name is, okay. but this is. Um... We're just not going to say their name. Yeah. Okay. Yes. So, but the... I'm telling you, man, I am so organized today. Yeah. And I'm actually. Mi no, this is it. All right, so we have a. Uh... Doo -doo -doo -doo. No, this is a small dandy. It's not this one. I guess I don't have that one over here, Miss Kitty. Okay. Anyway, I guess I'll just... A small dandy. Yeah, that was that Crow's Beak Small Dandy. Crow's Beak Small Dandy. Is that yeah, the one so. that I've already shipped? Does it show shipped? Are you on the right page? Hey, let's skip on up here I a little bit. I think you're on the wrong well, How'd I get that? Oh, I know what I did. She's getting all crazy. with It's Sunday, Miss Kitty. You leave me there's, alone. There's two different places that you can go, right. and you're just under sold. Yes, but what here's the deal. Let me explain this to you, Miss Kitty. Go under. I'm the boss. Needs to ship. I am your boss. <laughs> if you just pull up needs to ship, then you don't get the ones. Right, but I didn't ship. do that. Correct. Yeah. What I did, calm down, is I went to the last one that was on this list mm -hmm. sold, mm -hmm. which was the uh, or the first one, mm -hmm. and was that mm -hmm. that was still left? Correct. So that's what put me in. So then I went to the next one, but you'd already shipped it because you're right. on the job because I've holding, trained you well. I'm holding <laughs> this one back from shipment. Oh, because, because he's got another knife. So okay, it. man. All right, so, now that we have these technical difficulties figured out. <laughs> we can Sunday, move on. man. All right, we'll move on. Now this, man, this is the coolest steel hat man i sell a lot of old steel chainsaw hats and stuff but this one man is 1960s original i mean it is it's cool i've never i've never seen one like this man all insulated and everything that one was awesome i picked that up for a dollar 50 and got 3770 shipped Cha -ching! <laughs> that was a good one that was another one of those ones. I don't care if I sell it or not, I'll keep it. And it actually fit me. So it yeah. was pretty good. Mm, excuse me. This, uh, I read this book twice, actually. This is an awesome one. And I actually think we have another copy, copy in my collection that I may put up for uh, for sale, man. This is an awesome read. You know, and it's Idaho History, Salmon River. Um, it's the legacy of William Deadshot Reed, for better or for worse. Man, he was quite the... He was quite the hoorah, but uh, anyway, man. So I got the, sold that fourteen ninety five shipped, which is a dang good deal. Cause what's the price on that? They sell these brand new in uh, thirteen. Yeah. Oh, is it thirteen bucks? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. So fourteen ninety five shipped. I thought I paid fifteen for my first one. Cause the first one I bought brand new. Right. And I bought it in Cascade at the drugstore. Mm -hmm. So, so if you're in Cascade, you can actually save two bucks if you buy it there. <laughs> but if you're not, but if you're not, you can get one for me for fourteen ninety five. Shit. <laughs> All right. Then the next thing we have, and this is the same person. Mom, man, I might have to go down there and watch Daytona five hundred. I can't watch it up here, and that is serious business. Sorry about that. <laughs> and then, uh, so the next one, now he's the one, the same, my friend that bought the, same feller that bought the other one. I am so no, confused. No, this one, right, are you talking about this one here? Yeah. No, this is, um, um, he won the knife. Oh, okay, okay. okay. And the one that you're holding in your hand. Okay. Um, <laughs> Maybe you should be doing this part. Let's <laughs> hear it say it. We can do it together. Um, repeat customer. He's come back. He's bought some knives and um, loves them so much. And him and his wife both use them. So nope. first he got yeah he got two he got those and then bought two more. Mm -hmm. Yep. And he's actually one of our friends out there. So thank you very much. Thank you very much. So there's that one you can get okay. to him. And. 
I guess we oh that's we skipped those, don't we? So that one was the Raven Beak, and then the next one was the Thumb Saddle. Yes, and then the Thumb Saddle. Ding, 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 ding. So there's another one for them. Thank you. Thank you very much. And then we have these. Uh, this is Miss Kitty's. Like I said, she was an interior designer, you know, so she's all into this. These were actually actually came out of a. These ones that came out of the cabin. Of the, we found in a box of stuff. I don't know. Yeah, it's pretty anyway, cool. man, these little poles or knobs, man, they're ceramic with brass. Porcelain. Porcelain. Oh, sorry about that. It's porcelain with brass. It's okay. it's Miss like I said, Miss Kitty's department. But these, uh, we actually had on, I think, for $50 mm -hmm. plus shipping or something like that. And we ended up taking $45 shipped. Yeah, pretty good one. Yeah. <laughs> And then I got a, another repeat buyer on a, um, I'd actually made a, uh, uh, or pounded out a railroad spike knife for him, if you remember, on video and for his birthday. And now I'm making one for his other son for his birthday. So I'll be pounding that out and that'll be on video. And... So that's why you don't have it to show because it's... A pre-order right and this is we weren't going to talk about these um no okay no, sorry about that <laughs> but anyway so there's a few other things is that it well that's it and i'm being stingy about yeah. something you know and i mean um you know i try to give out information um you know as much as possible and all that and you know there's been a lot of uh um or there was you know back and forth on you know well, you tell you know putting all that stuff out because man uh you know we've even we've not got a lot of it but you know a little bit and i've seen when i back when i was watching you know a lot of ebay um videos and stuff of people saying how it's hurt the um you know sales on some things and um you know man whatever your opinion is on it um you know everybody that's why we live in america man we all got our opinions mm -hmm. but uh we have personally seen um, a few things affected by, yeah. you know, by getting out there on YouTube. And I mean, there's a lot of people watching them eBay videos and stuff. And, um, you know, just some of the stuff that they, you know, that gets put out there that, you know, the stuff that's easy to find. And right. that's the couple items that I skipped over is stuff that, you know, and not that I don't want you to make money, but I also right. don't want to, uh, you know, shoot myself in the foot. So what, you got it, man. You, you know, market. yeah. And if you're making these videos, and I mean, it's no different than when I was running the store doing the flea markets, man. I'm not going to, you know, give the guy next to me, hey, man, you can pick that up there, down there, you know, such and such. Man, I used to buy these. Uh, this is a good one. Kind of an example of the, uh, you know, of people, you know, and I have nothing against, you know, Man, if you want to tell everybody everything you've sold, you know, that's, man, yeah. and I do, I like to share the stuff, you know, but I should like to share the stuff that's the, you know, the weird and unusual. I mean, I'll tell you what, man, go out and find you one of them steel hats. They're hot, man, yeah. <laughs> but, but good luck. Yeah. <laughs> the first one I ever had. Yeah. But anyway, a good example of uh, one of those was those cobalt blue, uh, oh, uh, cobalt blue big planners remember those ones oh, the bases, man and old john bases. day is buying every dang yep. time the bases. yep but i man uh i used to have these get these cobalt blue vases man they were huge man and i had a guy that would come through and he'd buy every one of those and every show i would have two of them and i was guaranteed 50 bucks i was selling them to him for 25 bucks a piece and i was buying those at walmart for five bucks you know, and you can say, well, you're main, you know, but why would I go around and tell all those other, I was right. the only person in this flea market of 150 vendors, and man, I had people all the time, how do you always get those vases? I mean, I just come across them, yeah. you know, I mean, <laughs> you know, you don't shoot yourself in the foot, and the thing about it at the time is they were in the crafts. Right. They had those blue vases, and then there was none of them in the whole store unless you went over to the crafts department in one of them big Walmarts, and that's where I was mm -hmm. picking them up. Yeah, I, that was a long time ago. Yeah, that was, a lo that was 20 years ago, man. Yeah. That was before eBay. I mean, that was, you know, but man, I'm telling you, I saw every time, and the same guy, well, every once in a while, and he'd be bummed if he missed them, because, right. I mean, as soon as they opened the doors, because the flea market down in there in Boise Spectre, we did that one for, what, 20 years, mm -hmm. 25 years? I think it was 25 years we did that show. Yeah. 
Because we started about twenty. But no, because we started a couple of years after. Uh, I remember even because I was working at Henderson still when I we started doing that. Mm -hmm. So yeah, twenty. We did that show for yeah. twenty five years. <laughs> but anyway, um, when they opened the door on Saturday. Man, there was times that they'd be, I mean, it's a big fairgrounds, man. They'd be lined up all the way to the parking lot. And when they'd <coughs> open them doors, man, it was like just, it was almost like Black Friday, man. Yeah. They'd just, yeah. man, you're just handing out, man, money and stuff. The one time I couldn't even close my wallet, man. We'd made so much money that day. That was awesome, man. A thousand <laughs> bucks or something that day. $1 bill. Yeah, a lot of that, but it was <laughs> awesome. But anyway, man, that, uh, so that's kind of what, you know, I ain't putting that, you know, Man, do what you, you know. It's bad free country. You do whatever you want. But there's certain things that I just won't put out there because I'm not going to shoot myself in my own dang foot. Yeah. Because I guarantee those. The one would be a little bit harder. But uh, the other one, you know, yeah. <laughs> yeah, everybody. I mean, you could probably go out to your dang shed or garage right now and have it on before you, before I finish this video. Yeah. <laughs> but, um,. No, I guess the other way you go is for, you know, it's not like I got it hiding, man, because it's out there, you know. Right. Some of it I put on, uh, which yeah. I've actually backed off because I built that other account up for them um, and got it to where I want because I got them to be a, a power seller and stuff. You know, started from basically nothing, built that one. We've done real well on that one, too. And now I'm just kind of weeding my, I still got, what, 60, 60, items on there. Yeah, 60 or 70 yeah. items on it. But I'm, uh, she's going to actually start taking over her own, you know, she sold stuff too, you know, put in stuff there. in yeah. there, but yeah. yeah, we've done real well, but that was the main, what I was trying to get them was up to power seller. And I think that was the 10th or 12th eBay account that we've built. Mm -hmm. We've built mm -hmm. six or seven, seven for, yeah. yeah, several of them for other people. What did you got anything else, Miss Kitty? This ain't a real huge... Well, Anything else um, on the eBay front? Yeah, I've got um, I've got the last ma mountain jumper comment video here pulled up. So oh, that okay. We can go through and see if there's any questions there. I don't know if you can see them in my stickers. Back here. Saint Bernard Acres. Yep. Um, Bat Wood Anonymous. Yep, she's awesome. This is Shalisa. Yep, Shalisa. Yeah, she's awesome. She's real fun. By Idaho. By Idaho. <laughs> a vintage sticker. We love that one. Then our YouTube, YouTube sticker. And and you can't see it up top of there. There's one up there that says it looks just like YouTube. Yeah, it's Katie or Kitty's favorite. So you dork. You dork. And then of course our. You like gotta have old Bob. There. Like doing it cheap. I need to get our uh, ours on there too. So any of y'all that have a uh, um, YouTube stickers or um you know stickers of yourself or whatever man send them send them to us we can use them like a postcard then we can stick them on our thing mm -hmm. <laughs> okay okay so back to um, mountain junkers yes sir. um let me find his name this is james gagger james gagger quick question how do you get customers to leave feedback i'm starting an ebay store and have sold three items but i can't get any of them to leave feedback love the channel yeah. I'll tell you, do you want to take that? No. Go oh, okay. Yeah. I'll tell you how uh, the first thing that I do um, when I go to, um, you know, build my channel or build one for somebody else, the first thing I do is I get in there and I spend 10 or 20 bucks, or not 10 or 20 bucks, I spend whatever I want to spend, you know, I don't even know why I said 10 or 20 bucks, to try to get, you know, say 10, 10 or 20 feedbacks, I'll go in there and anything that we're wanting to purchase or if the, you know, if it's for us mm -hmm. and even if it's not for us, then um, I'll put money in the person that I'm building the account for is PayPal and we'll buy whatever. Cause we're, you know, I mean, obviously all of us, you guys too, we all are, you know, buying stuff on eBay and stuff all the time. And so what I'll do is I'll go in there and I'll buy some stuff and um you know get a few feedbacks so that i have you know a few going there um and then the sales i mean the only thing you can really do is uh um you know i personally we or we personally as uh sellers we don't leave feedbacks till we get a feedback and do you want to explain that yeah go Why for it. That? um every Every seller, every buyer has their opinion about the feedback um, system on eBay. And our opinion 
is formed because we've been doing eBay since 2003. And in 2003, the feedback system was completely different than it is now. Um, I, I just wanted to say that right up front mm -hmm. because... It was better. It, it was yeah. because back then, the seller <coughs> negative feedback <coughs> for the buyer. So if the buyer makes the purchase but doesn't pay for it, you could leave that feedback on that buyer. But now, you cannot do that. So... Our opinion is based on our experience, so that this is why we have this opinion. Um, the transaction is not complete until they receive their item, and you have the opportunity to work out any problems, if there are any. So that's why we don't leave the feedback until we receive it, because the transaction, in our opinion, is not complete until they receive their item. So that's why we do that. Some sellers choose to automatically leave a feedback for the buyer as soon as they pay. Or as soon as they purchase. Well, I mean, everybody, and that's all right. everybody yeah. does it their you own know. way. And most of the time, you know, the ones that we get automatically mm -hmm. like that are usually on like DVDs mm -hmm. and, you know, stuff like that. But, you know, yeah. so I mean, it's each to their own. Right. But as far as his question, man, there's really not much. You, you know, you can ask him, hey, man, could you, so, yeah, you just know. send him a quick note and say. Well, he said he did. Okay. I think he said he'd asked him a couple of times. So, yeah, it's. uh. You can't force somebody. Yeah, to, not everybody does it. In the feedback system. Right. It's not mandatory. And a lot of the bigger, bigger buyers and bigger sellers never do feedbacks, yeah. you know either and some of them you know I've, I've noticed that uh ones that are real good about it even if you're you know man, it don't matter if you opened up a case or whatever but uh it's good the goodwill yeah. stores and stuff man they're you know they're really good man as soon as you buy something man they leave you a feedback yeah, it's like you can set your account up right right but he's selling so he's trying to get them right. from selling stuff so right. man all you can do is just hang tough man yeah. keep at it you know and if you want you know so that you have a little bit of account like i said i'd just buy some stuff man you can get on there and buy you some you know, packing, shipping, uh, yeah. you know, just some little, little things and yeah. get you a little bit of a thing going there. Yeah. So, yeah. One of the things our kids do around Christmas time is yeah, they um, have a competition to see who can purchase the least expensive item on eBay and they'll pay a penny free shipping. So there's, there's some crazy auctions out there that you can make purchases and get quick feedback. Right, They're right. Tiny, yeah. you know, within pennies. Yeah, that stuff that yeah. they were getting that one time. They were doing that at Christmas. And they were so getting funny. some cool stuff, yeah, man, for got, like 49 cents yeah, from China and all this. Teeny, tiny, little, microscopic, copper bullion bar. Yeah, yeah. For, and it was like yeah, man, it 50 cents free shipping. Yeah, it was, awesome. it was yeah. creepy. It was creepy. Right. What else you got? I'm, I'm just doing a quick scan again to make sure I didn't miss anything, but I think that... Oh, I want to say congratulations to Tony Bryant. They made their first eBay sale. Sweet. You are welcome. Thanks yep. for all your advice. That's awesome. Yep. I and, think that's it. Yeah, we didn't get a bunch. So, I mean, any questions that you have, you know, that we can help you with or answer and sub, make sure and leave in the comments with a Q&A, and we'll uh, get that on next week's uh, Mountain Junkers. Um, the other thing, and I hadn't said it in the last few videos, is get your postcards in for yes. the next... Uh, Next drawing, when we hit 12,000 subscribers, we'll do another drawing. So get your postcards in there for that. And like I said, if you got stickers and stuff, man, you're, you know, if you're... Because what I want to do on this is all... I want to do all YouTube... Um, you know, yeah, mm -hmm. stickers and stuff yeah. of creators and stuff like that. So Your I think that'd be kind of cool. You know, and the van life ones and stuff. Because we got friends that are, yeah, you know, that the van life and mm -hmm. um, all that that side we're all over the place man yeah. <laughs> i had somebody else in the uh, bobs are you the are you the same idaho hillbilly that goes to much, the, much, the oh, oh no okay. that was another that one was yeah another, another, another one funny. are you the same idaho hillbilly that's in the uh reseller network how about you yeah that's that's right yeah, I mean. <laughs> and then the other one was are you the idaho hillbilly that makes you know, that mushroom, mushroom that <laughs> yeah. yes sir yeah. that me <laughs> we just try to go everywhere man yeah. But you got anything else in? Nope. That's I it. That's it. So I guess short and sweet, man. Yeah. Like I said, that was just uh, Friday night and Saturday. Mm -hmm. And then actually the ones that I said I sold this morning were actually, man, the uh, other, items. other items. And so I guess uh, that's it, man. Hopefully you have lots of sales. And man, remember to, the only way you can make money on eBay is to list, list, list. Yeah. List, list, list. Okay. Point at that. <laughs> you see my plaque back there? I love that thing. Yeah. So good Lord willing and the cricks don't rise. We'll be back again tomorrow. <laughs>